Hello. In this video, let me show you how you're going to use the bonus and reimbursement feature of Fluidbiz HRM. On the left-hand navigation menu, click on bonus and reimbursement. Here you'll see all these uh, sub-menus open up. First, click on bonus types. Uh, in uh, Fluidbiz, you can issue two different types of bonus, group bon bonus and individual bonus. To add a new bonus type, click on the add link out here. So, uh, enter the name of the bonus type, the company with which it is attached and a bonus is based on basic or gross or amount of the salary of the employee uh, and all these other uh, you know uh, fields in the green section and you have to select the bonus type and the number of months the employee has to be eligible to be uh, num the employee has to be working with the company to be eligible for this bonus type etc so enter all this information out here and these fields are optional so the fields in the green section are the ones which you need to enter and submit this form so once you do so uh, the bonus type is going to appear for you out here now these are the uh, bonus types that you have added and if you want to issue this bonus to a particular group of employees so you need to uh, click on this blue button out here against the name of the bonus click on issue bonus select the month and the year and the bonus amount and that uh, amount would be actually added to the uh, payslip of that particular set of employees because when you added the bonus in the second step of addition of the bonus you would have already selected which job titles would be eligible for that particular bonus so those job titles for that particular month and year this bonus amount would be added to their pay slips automatically. Now, uh, next comes individual employee bonus. If you want to give them some performance bonus or any type of individual bonus, for that, click on view employee bonus. You'll uh, view the list of your employees out here. Clicking on the name of the employee, you would be able to view that uh, what's the group bonus and what's the individual bonus this employee has received so far. And to issue an, um, uh, an individual uh, bonus for this particular employee, just click on the issue bonus um, uh, link against the name of the employee. Select the month and year on which the bonus would be uh, paid to him and enter the amount and the bonus type, or the, you know, which is the bonus type that you're paying to him or her and click on the submit button once you do so that amount of money would be added as a bonus amount in his or her paisley for that particular month and year you don't have to do anything more manually so that's how you'd be managing the bonus for your employees next coming to reimbursement uh, this is an important setting you need to add your reimbursement types uh, before your employees can submit reimbursement applications via Luidbiz ESS. To add the reimbursement type, click on the add link out here. Enter the uh, name of the reimbursement type, company with which it is attached and the tax percentage and the number of supporting documents that this reimbursement type uh, involves, that is the number of supporting documents that employees need to submit if they are claiming this particular type of reimbursement. So depending on the number of uh, documents, supporting documents you enter out here, in the next step you'd have to uh, enter the names of those documents and also select which uh, job titles would be eligible for that particular type of reimbursement and then add the reimbursement. Once you add the reimbursement type you can view it out here and against that reimbursement type your employees can fill out the reimbursement form in the ESS module and submit to you and once they submit the reimbursement application you can view it out here in reimbursement applications as new application so against each application um, uh, you have the action of uh, you know either approving rejecting or sending it for approval to someone else in Fluidbiz ESS. It could be that this employee's uh, manager or his uh, supervisor. Uh, and to view the details of the reimbursement application, click on the application number on this list and you can view the details of this particular reimbursement application. If the employee has attached any document as a support proof, you can view the document by clicking on this link out here. And if you have your, instead of sending this application for someone else in ESS to approve it, if you have approved it yourself, you can view the list of approved applications you have done so far. If you have asked for a resubmission, you can view it out here. And if you have rejected this uh, reimbursement application, you can view it out here. And if you have sent this particular leave application for, appro uh, for approval to someone else in Luitbiz ESS, you can view it out here. The next are the reports. You can view the bonus reports out here in both text and in graphical formats. As f and as far as uh, reimbursement reports are concerned, you can view the company reimbursement reports and the employee reimbursement reports by clicking on either of these links. That's how you manage bonus and reimbursements in Fluidbiz HRM. Thank you for watching.